Hi friends, this is a video that explains you how to apply for the online one year PGT program step by step. First and foremost, please go to this website which is appliedroots.com which is a parent website for all of our programs. So as soon as you go to appliedroots.com, so as soon as you click on appliedroots.com, it will take you to a page like this which has all of the programs that we currently offer in addition to the one year PG program. Now here we have highlighted the one year PG program and you can simply click on the no more here. So the moment you click on no more, it opens a dedicated page for the one year PG program. And the URL for this is appliedroots.com front slash PG hyphen diploma, right? So as soon as you go here, you can apply by just clicking on apply now. You can just click on this button here. If you just click on this button apply now, again, if you have not yet registered and logged into applied roots, it will take you to a login page. Again, if you have not yet registered, please click on this register button, which will open a registration form like this. Again, this is for registration on applied routes. Please provide your full name, your valid email address, valid mobile phone number and set your password. Please provide accurate email address and mobile phone number because we will use this information to communicate with you. Now, once you have registered, you can just click on login and you can log in. Once you have logged in, you'll get a page like this, which shows my account and log out, right? Once you've come here, you can just click on apply now, which will take you to a page like this. Now, any questions, any concerns or anything that you don't know about filling this form, feel free to call us on this number or this number or drop an email at this email address, right? So as soon as you come to this application form, Again, please note that there is an application fee of 300 rupees, which is non-refundable. And this fee is used towards verification of all of your academic documents and credentials. So as soon as you come here, the application number, the application date and the, and the course name are auto-filled. You just have to give in all of your details here. Again, please fill all these details accurately as per your matriculation or 10th class or SSC certificate details. Any errors in this could be a concern later. So please fill in your name, father's name, mother's name, your permanent address and address for correspondence. Again, please fill in correct details because the final certificate and the mark sheets will be delivered to these addresses at the end of your one year PG program, right? So then you have miscellaneous information about your phone number, date of birth, gender, nationality, etc. One of the most important things here is your education qualifications. This is for your 10th class or equivalent. Please fill in what board you, you passed your 10th class or equivalent in, the year of passing, the maximum marks and the marks obtained. Again, please click on this link and add, your, add a photograph of your certificate or a scanned copy of your certificate. If you don't have the certificate readily available right now, you can fill in this form. You can come back a day or two later and you can update it wherein you can add your certificate later, right? First fill in the form in case you don't have all the certificates ready, that's okay. First fill in all the details, right? You can update and add the certificate at a later point also, but try to do it in just a few days after you fill in the form. Similarly, you need, you need to provide the details for your 10th class or diploma or equivalent. Similarly, you have to upload your certificate for your graduation or post-graduation along with marks. Again, if you have previous or currently you're employed somewhere, please fill in all of your details here, right? You can enter details of multiple workplaces by just clicking on add new and adding more details. At the end of this whole thing, please click on the register button. Again, please understand that you need to provide accurate and correct information. Any discrepancies in the application would result in disqualification. If any errors are found at a later time, the PG degree or the PG diploma that is given by University of Hyderabad will be nullified in case of there is any error, intentional or not. So please try to fill this form as accurately as you can based on the certificates that you have. Now, once, once you click on the register button, it will take you to the online payment portal for University of Hyderabad. University of Hyderabad uses State Bank of India for their payments. So this is a dedicated payment portal of SBI for University of Hyderabad. Now, as soon as you go here, just click on, I have read accepted the terms and proceed. Again, this portal might be sometimes slightly slow. So please be patient. 
this going through this portal might take a few more minutes based on whether you are using 4G connection or not. So please be patient while making this 300 rupees application fee payment. Now once you click on this, it will take you to a portal like this. This is a dedicated payment portal for University of Hyderabad. Once you go here, just go here and select distance education registration fee, right? Because that's what you want to pay, right? So just click on this and then just wait for a minute or so. It will take you to a dedicated page like this. Now in this page, please provide your name, your accurate date of birth. For the course, you just have to fill in this. Again, this is not pre-filled. You just have to fill in P-G-D-A-I-M-L. Right. So as far as the course is concerned, just fill in this. You have to manually fill this in. The distance education registration fee is 300 rupees, which is auto filled. It's a fixed 300 rupees fee. Right. Along with it, please fill in all of your other details also. Fill in your correct email address, your mobile phone number, etc. And as soon as you do it, as soon as you click the submit button, it will open up a portal and you can make payment of 300 rupees of application fee as soon as you click your submit button. Again, please try to fill all the accurate details so that you get all the confirmations accordingly. After you've made the payment, please take a screenshot and share the screenshot of the payment of 300 rupees to our email address. Again, as soon as you fill this whole application form at Applied Roots, you will get a confirmation email from pgduoh at appliedroots.com, right? Saying that you have applied for this and to that email, please respond back with a confirmation of the payment of 300 rupees, right? At any point, if you have any issues with payment or filling this form, please reach out to us. We will help you in that process, right? Again, please note that you should fill all the details as accurately as you can because errors in this could disqualify you.